fuck you looking at? Saving that bitch don't mean shit. You still a murderer. That's the Kugi, motherfucker. I know what it's like to take a life. You can smoke all the weed you want, but that ain't gonna make the shit go away. Man, fuck them people, all right? Fuck them. I ain't never got that advice. Will you stop giving a fuck what people think? You'll be much happier. Oh, what you doing for money? Stealing packages from people's doors and pawning what's inside. That's what the fuck I'm doing for money. I'm trying to help you find a real job. Bro, why do you give a fuck? Why, nigga? This ain't nobody do it for me. I ain't trying to live here. So what you trying to be homeless? All right. Proper responses, thank you. Thank you. So what you want to be when you get older, shorty? I don't know. But you don't got no dreams, nothing? Fuck that nigga, bro. What? Hey, come on. Look, look all right. You can't be out here beefing with the doorman. Bro, he said some shit to me. That's why I said some shit to him. What's wrong with that? That's what them dudes do. Hey, 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 bro. Who the fuck is that, nigga? Trust me, she don't want you. What up, Lene? Hey, Papa. I like your braids. Thank you. Uh, Lene, this is Bakari. Hi. Hey. Hey! Fuck! And my girl lost our baby because of you! I ain't know. Man, get the fuck out of my house, nigga! Can I stay with you, bro? Yeah. I ain't mean for that shit to happen. I know, but you should still try to make things right. Maybe you want to kick it sometime? I know what you did. Look, I ain't do that shit on purpose. I know. Good. Come on, uh, we got to go. Bro, where? You said you was going to talk to Jake and Gemma. Yeah, you should handle that first, and then we can hang out. You for real? Yeah. What the fuck you want, nigga? Just wanted to say I was sorry. I appreciate you coming over here. I know it took a lot to do so. Thank you. Do you ever dream? What you mean? Like, do you ever think about what you want to be when you get older? Mm, not really. Me either, but lately I've been thinking about that shit a lot. If you got a crazy story, why don't you tell it? What? Write that shit down. So you don't think I'm a bad person? No. I just think you ain't have nobody. But now we do. What's up with you, shorty? Man, I'm doing really, really good. Too. You look different. Yeah, I figured out my dream, bro. Is that right? Yeah. Well, get it to me. I'm gonna write a book. You gonna write a book? Yep. What the fuck you gonna write about? <laughs> my life. Like, nigga, you only 16. Yeah, I know, but I've seen a lot of shit, bro. Don't do that. Don't even do that shit. Fuck you want? I want you to be my eyes and ears. Why you all dressed up? I got a new job. You doing what? Some real nigga shit. Sounds illegal to me. Hey, I'd rather be doing this than fucking boosting packages. I don't fuck with criminals. I've been seeing you running around with Otis and his crew. All money ain't good money. Both of you all need to be worried about your futures and keeping your nose in the good book. Well, I think I'm gonna excuse myself. No, no. You're part of this family, too. You stay right there. See so you running around with Duda now, huh? It's temporary. It's what we all say. You playing with fire, shorty. Why can't you just get a normal job? 
and you go with this bullshit. Hmm, yeah, here I go with this bullshit. You wanna go there? Let's go there. I'm not about to bust my ass for 40 hours a week just to get by. Nay, I'm not. Then maybe we shouldn't be together. I'm not trying to watch you die. Look at me. I'm not gonna have to, right? You promise? Promise. Nah, that's the one. Oh! Look at the fucking rims, dawg. You like it? I love it. Yeah, that's good. Find a place to stash these. Got you. I'll figure something out. Yeah. I love you. I love you too. You look a little nervous. You okay, boy? You want me to meet all the brother? Just remember these three things. Always look them in the eye. Extend your hand first. And when you walk away, do it with confidence. No matter what transpires. Yes, sir. All right. Keep my sister safe. You hear me? Bye. Don't get her caught up in none of your bullshit. See all I got. Trust me. Hold on. This is for losing my motherfucking car. My man's on punishment. She can't have any visitors. She won't apologize. It wasn't her fault. It was mine. Shouldn't have had her in that car. She all I have to live for. Oh, shit. That's my sister. Hey, hold up, G. I thought you had no family. We spent our childhood together. But as we got older, our parents couldn't look out to us no more, so she went to a foster home. Went to another. Yo! What's up? What up? Hi, I'm Lene, Bakari's girlfriend. Oh, tell me about you. Bro, listen, we just caught up for a few moments, but uh, we mean it now. Bakari, I need to have a word with you. You need to talk to him. We need to be present. No, he doesn't need a chaperone. Oh, but he got two of them right here, though. So. My dad was a noble man. And he got killed for it. I loved your father. Like he was my but own. He's not your father. He's mine. He always wanted us to be our best selves. He did. He did. He did. I know you heard it, but this isn't the way to handle it. Then how do I end it, since you know so much? Go for a walk. Journal. Get some fresh air. Oh, you sound like an after-school special night. Just don't give up on yourself. Too late. <sighs> what the fuck? Koi? I never needed you to avenge my death. I had you. And it didn't make you feel better, did it? No. I know you're haunted by it. I'm trying to do better. Oh, no. I don't want you to die for me, Kari. I want you to live the life that I couldn't. <laughs> 